Good morning. How y'all doing? We are in the forest again, boondocking. We are in Kebab National Forest right before you get to Tusayan. Little town right there at the Grand Canyon. Look at our backyard. You hear the birds? Very nice. It's very peaceful out here. A few trucks up and down the road, but not many. This is Memorial Day weekend. And there we sit. Here's our front yard. When there aren't cows covering it. Yes, there are cows. Free grazing here. And there's an RV back over there somewhere. Ponderosa pines, aren't they gorgeous? Just gorgeous. That's a big one there. And there's Shirley. And over here is our friends, Roseanne and Mike. But it's nice and quiet. Of course, there's no fires because fire... Uh, oh, something came on. Heard our generator in the background. Uh, no fires because the fire hazard is high. You can have a propane... Uh, gas heater or our stove or whatever but no fire on the ground period yeah it's pretty sweet out here pretty sweet indeed and I got some little clips of the cows it's funny one of them we have our water that ponderosa pine behind the trailer there we have a water jug, one of those six-gallon jugs with water in it back there. And she proceeded to take the lid off of it and was trying to get water out of it. <laughs> so, yeah. Yep. We went to the Grand Canyon yesterday to see the sunrise. Oh, my gosh, that was just gorgeous. Gorgeous. We went for an evening walk yesterday with the sunset. That was pretty cool, too. But it's about, let's see, the temperature here is uh, it's supposed to be a high of 67. It's probably about 55 right now. Got down to 28 last night. It's pretty cool. But look, just a slight breeze today. The sun feels great. And we went to the Grand Canyon yesterday morning to see the sunrise. Oh my gosh, it was so cold. But we made it. And we had a really good time. And it was just absolutely gorgeous. But going to the Grand Canyon, if you do not have a pass, a senior pass, they're charging $35 for the seven days to go. Well, we went, we put our tag, our card up in the windshield, and we didn't have a problem. Of course, they only have it open on the weekends, uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, I think is what the days are. And they're closed the rest of the time, and they only have part of the park open. But the little town of uh, Toussignan, Toussignan? I think it is. Um, it's a cute little town. It's only about a mile long, if that. <laughs> but they got an IMAX theater that's closed. Uh, most of the hotels there were open. Uh, they do have one little tiny grocery store. Of course, they have a trading post. Uh, they have all this touristy stuff there. Uh, but... Of course, the tourists aren't here. There were not many people in the park yesterday either. So, this is Sunday morning. And it's a gorgeous, gorgeous morning. 
I'm going to put the drone up so y'all can see the vastness of the place. Yeah, we're enjoying it here. We thought about moving closer to town because um, our Verizon service is not strong enough to upload a video. However, we can watch movies from the internet, you know, Netflix and all that. And I can answer messages and whatnot. It's just that we can't upload. I only have one little bar on my phone of 4G. But this is freedom. Yep, this is freedom. Look at them blue skies. Oh my goodness, is that not gorgeous? Wow. And tonight... Uh, Roseanne is cooking tonight. Shirley cooked last night. Uh, we had chili that we made the day before yesterday. And uh, we had tacos and the chili. So we're doing the community thing. <laughs> it's awesome. Shirley's making dessert tonight and I'm making cornbread. So but that's how you do it in this world. Yep. Kind of stick together. This road goes way down there. There's plenty of camping. There's little roads, little fingers off, all over the place up and down this road. There was a couple campers up in there. I guess they all left this morning. Wow. But our camp, look at this. Is that not a nice camp? Very nice. We love it nice and quiet big front yard nice and the road coming in is not bad at all it is not bad at all So this cow is after our water jugs, which Bobby has right here at the tree. Yesterday, she took the cap off of it and tried to suck the water out of it. <laughs> it's right here. <laughs> that one. Well, that's the one she got a hold of. So I'm just going to use the rest of that water for washing my hands and all. It had the spout on it right here. Trying to suckle on it. <laughs> She's trying to suckle on it. You need to go. Come on. <laughs> Mr. Childers, the cow whisperer. <laughs> 